Mom's Heart. Uh, so you'll see the scores down at the bottom are 0-0 zero, zero right now. First one to take out Mom's Heart will get a point. We'll reset both racers back to the basement one, and we'll start from scratch. Uh, so again, uh, I know that they can hear me because uh, Eddie definitely said that they could. Creepily. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> totally joking. Anyways, uh, but nonetheless, they can hear me. Uh, they are on a Skype call together, so I don't have to do the countdown. They will do it themselves at their convenience. Uh, so anytime they're ready, we'll get that rolling. And I can see that we can't see the K and Cobalt's name. So let me try that. Oh, look at that. Much better. Now we can read it. Awesome. Actually, I should probably put that... Yeah, that's good enough right there. Anywho, uh, so like I was saying, uh, basically it's all straightforward. Uh, if you get any expendable items, you can use them however you want. You can bomb through doors with your... Let's say you have one bomb, like Cobalt does and Eddie does at the moment. If they wanted to bomb through a door with that, they could. If they want to save it for a secret room, that's their prerogative. Uh, basically, expendable items are yours to do as you wish with... Um, the only other rule I can think of is if on the womb too, because that's where we race to in the regular season. If you skip past mom's heart, so if you take pills or something like that that gets you into the I am error room, and by the way we are underway, uh, let me also explain that since I am recapturing both streams, even though they started at the exact same time, because they are, excuse me, talking to each other, on my screen it looked a little bit offset. That's just because I'm recapturing streams, that's all there is to that. And Cobalt with that item, Magneto says, no thanks, he'll be restarting his run. Excuse me again. Oh, sorry about that, excuse me. Uh, so it looks like an attack fly, Forever Alone for Eddie Ruckus, very nice find. I've had a few runs where I've had both of the attack flies and stuff like, uh, oh, I can't think of the name now, Infestation. By the way, Lard is Cobalt's uh, new first item. Once again says, no thanks, because of that speed down and the enlarged uh, hitbox. So that would have been nice health up for Cobalt, but at the same point would have made the hitbox on his character humongous and probably given him more damage and a lot slower walking speed than he should have. So he'll say no thanks once again. Ooh, that one he's going to take, though. Money equals power to start. Ooh, nice find. All right, so that is an immediate two damage up for Cobalt Streak on the left. Uh, any time that he picks up any multiple of 10 cents. So right now he's at zero. And there's Dad's key. Cobalt's probably going to use it just so he doesn't see it again. Actually, he's going to take it. Ah, I see the reasoning. Even though he has no bombs, he's going to leave that D6 behind. He's going to hope that he can open up a Devil Deal in here, or God Room, one of the two. That is the basically the only use I've found for Dad's key so far. Yeah, Lard, for winter. <laughs> <coughs> oh, God, I just read Bobby Brown, my prerogative. Oh, Lord. It's my prerogative. I'm going to have that stuck in my head all night. Now you are, too. Enjoy my hell, folks. <laughs> oh, God. I love that. We call those hum jobs. Yes, the pun is intended. Yeah, money equals money? <laughs> so there's Mom's Pearl for Eddie Ruckus as a trinket that, uh, if I'm not mistaken, is a 10% chance to turn red heart spawns into soul heart spawns instead. Uh, so again, the red hearts are just like, think of them like Zelda. Um, exact same reasoning. You can fill up the empty containers. Uh, with the blue hearts, the soul hearts, think of those as like Minecraft armor. Uh, basically, once they're gone, they're gone. You will not see an empty spot for them, it's just they're gone. There's that red heart pickup by Cobalt. You'll Actually, that's not Nightem Rock. Never mind, I thought he had Nightem Rock. <coughs> Excuse me again. Uh, so there is the item box for Cobalt. So one of basically everything from a pill to a card to a trinket, a bomb, a key, and a coin. He'll leave the coin, or the uh, the pill, rather, as he always does. Uh, Cobalt is one of the racers who has to see two of the same type of pills on the same floor to even consider taking them. Unless he's got the lucky foot or something to that effect. And let's see, that is Blood Rites for Cobalt Streak in his item room. Uh, that basically does damage to everything in the room at the cost of damage to yourself. So again, it's a little bit of a hit and miss type of item. And Cobalt did not want to be in the room he was in. So again, Dad's Key will open up doors as long as you're in a battle like that. So Cobalt basically, instead of using a bomb to bomb back out, says, No thanks, I'll just use Dad's Key, because I don't need the charge. Uh, let's see, Eddie just picked up Guardian Angel. So that is a double speed orbital that'll block shots for him. And also make any other uh, orbital that he picks up spin at double speed. How's up, Jarday? How you doing? And again, what's up, everybody? Good to see everyone tonight. Hope you guys are uh, having a much better day than I am. Because so far, I've just been hosed over every possible turn here. So, uh, yeah, it's been a bad one for me. But like I said, hopefully you guys are doing a lot better than I am. Uh, I know that personally, like, I'm feeling a lot better now that we got races going on. It makes me feel a little bit more normal. So, back to normalcy here. But feeling good, feeling good. Hope you guys are enjoying the races, too. 
All right, so let's see. Dual famine fights, and there's Dad's keys working wonder, or Dad's key working wonders. Boy, I can't talk. So there you go. It has a chance that it'll actually pop open a devil deal in your boss fight. Same with the God Room, by the way. Uh, Cobalt takes the mark for damage, and I believe that is range up. Uh, Eddie, looking at his devil deal, says, "Wow!" Actually, says no thanks to both the lucky foot and the nail. That's that's interesting. Yeah, there's no quality buttons for some reason on my channel. I don't know what happened tonight, sent. Uh, but yeah, it, you're, it's not just you. There's a few people that have them, but not very many. So I don't know what the deal is with that, but uh, I am broadcasting in 720p, so hopefully that isn't restricting anybody from watching. Uh, so you should be getting it in 720p, I hope. If it really makes it look like 360, though, there's an issue, because that means that my transcoders are just jacked right now, and there's nothing I can do. So either way, there really isn't anything I can do about it, sadly. Uh, but yeah, usually I have quality buttons. They're just non-existent tonight. And no idea why. So let's see, Eddie going to use that one bomb to grab his item chest, which thankfully had a bomb and a key in it, mind you. So he's going to be able to get into his item room when he comes across it this time a lot faster than on the last floor. Uh, again, let's see, right now both racers are on the same floor, even though it says Catacombs 1 for Eddie, that is actually still a Caves 1. It is just the expansion version. Speaking of keys, he gets a second one. Ooh, speaking of lives, Cobalt's got a second one. Not saying that he's risking it right now with that one red heart, but it's, it's it's at least a little bit of a leeway to know that he's got that backup. Oh, some Colts. How you doing? Uh, looks like the uh, setting you usually have, uh, though, it might just be something on your side. Huh, interesting. That's really weird. I don't know what happened tonight, so that's it's really weird. Like, my cast wouldn't go live for me for the first 20 minutes I was live. So I'm having some weirdness happen to me tonight. I don't know what it is. It's probably Comcast, honestly. <laughs> I'll, I'll put it on Comcast. It's a safe bet. So let's see. Eddie's got his item room here. Ooh, mulligans. So speaking of those fly runs, like I was talking about earlier, now watch this. You know what else is cool with that is if you get Sacred Heart. You're welcome, Eddie. Because apparently I'm calling these things, so let's see if I am correct here. By the way, if I am, the rest of the races are off. I'm going to the casino. Yep, and that troll bomb usage. Cobalt's one of the people that I know that can actually make troll bombs work very well for him. Uh, again, like, if you know that you've got an item rock and, let's say, a troll bomb spawns in the room, like, Cobalt is just perfect on the timing with that. Like, I never expect one to spawn, but Cobalt's always, like, dead perfect on the timing. He'll walk it right over to whatever item rock he sees, or let's say there's another enemy in the room. Like, he knows exactly where to put those. Yeah, when in doubt, playing Comcast. <laughs> That's really weird. I wonder if it defaulted to 360 somehow, like within Twitch itself, because I'm broadcasting at 720p and 60 frames a second. So, I mean, it even says I'm on, like, on OBS and I'm casting at 60, so it, it shouldn't be from my end. I hope. <laughs> if it is, something got really screwed up and I have no idea how. Hey, what's up, Mr. Major? How you doing tonight? But yeah, like, for two days, Comcast has been derping on me, so I just, I kind of assume... All right, so Eddie's got Pestilence right now. That is his second uh, horseman fight that he is in. Uh, basically, that means that he's going to get a second cube of meat here as a result. Uh, Cobalt just about finished off with Peep. Again, both of these racers are in the exact same room right now. So we are dead even at the moment, folks. Uh, again, Cobalt's got the bit of an advantage for actually having Peep dead at the moment. There's some health up that he pretty well needed. Again, it's Cobalt. He doesn't actually need health, but you get the idea. It's always nice to have red hearts. I'm just saying, I have faith in the man. I'm not I'm not doubting him. And I forgot to explain the mulligan, by the way. Uh, some of Eddie's shots are actually going to be uh, friends till the end flies. So basically more attack flies will spawn out of Eddie and head towards enemies. Uh, so again, you can see a few of them there. Uh, not the one that's basically keeping orbit around him. Uh, but any others. Wow, that was close. Pestilence almost ended Eddie's run right there. That was really close. And wow, I was going to say, that's going to get a little close, too. Eddie going to wait out that green uh, killy stuff on the ground. Grab that heart, grab his second cube of meat, and head on down to Caves 2. So just a couple of rooms behind Cobalt right now. Ooh, and a Curse of Darkness for Eddie. Not what you want to see. Again, it's an early on floor. That isn't so bad. But you'll notice Eddie will not get to see his mini map on this floor. Even if he were to pick up the compass and or the, uh, the treasure map, still will not show.
Hey, what's up, Beaster Mode? How you doing tonight? Uh, if what was spam? I didn't even see it, honestly, facet, so... I don't care. <laughs> Personally, I could care less. I didn't even see it, so... To me, no, it wasn't. <laughs> Wouldn't even worry about it. <laughs> Too cat. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh my lord. Yeah, Cobalt's mouth just dropped open. I just saw his jaw hit the ground. So there's Polyphemus for Cobalt. We've seen that one a few times at this point, haven't we, guys? That is ridiculous tier size, as you can see. So Cobalt's a very happy man. I just saw his jaw hit the ground as though, like, you know, like freaking Kira Knightley just walked past him stark naked or something. That was just that... <laughs> like you'd almost, like, feel his tongue wrapping back up into his mouth there. See, the only problem with, uh, and you'll notice the difference, look at Eddie's tier rate, so notice how many tiers Eddie fires out as quickly as he does. Now look at Cobalt's side and look at how slow his is. That's the only dilemma with Polyphemus. You get huge damage up and your tier rate is so disgustingly slow. But again, it's, it's, you can very easily work with it. It's not like it's something that debilitates you in any way. It's just, man, your shots are so, so slow. So you're hoping at this point to see almost nothing but tears up. Absolutely, I can, Nesker, or Nesser, sorry. Probably completely botched the uh, pronunciation of your name, and I apologize. Uh, if I could spell. That's your winner. And thank you whoever actually updated that one. Because I totally didn't write that beginning part, but thank you very much. There's Spazbot with the uh, game fetch link for any for everybody. Pardon me. Um, that'll get you into both uh, race, yeah, both racers channels. Boy, I cannot talk tonight. I was trying to say Eddie just picked up the game kit, which you're about to see him use here. Uh, basically, it turns you into Pac-Man. You get to heal as you kill enemies because uh, you're basically eating them. Uh, so that is a huge, 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 huge help for Eddie right now because he needed some heals. <laughs> so that is a huge find. Yeah, absolutely, Matt. Absolutely, sir. Did I add you on uh, on Skype? I'm pretty sure I did, didn't I, Matt? And yeah, I know I did. Never mind. I know full well I did. But yeah, absolutely, sir. Uh, let me get that for you. It is... Again, I can't spell for crap. There we go. Spazbot's got the, uh, the dual link for you. That game fetch link will get you into both channels. Oh, my. Wow. That's a risky move right there. Cobalt took Brimstone. Mind you, he's got Polyphemus already, so Brimstone is now the most ridiculously overpowered tool you could possibly... There you go. Case in point. Uh, nonetheless, Cobalt has half a blue heart. That's it. Speaking of blue hearts, Eddie just picked up the relic in his god room. That'll spawn a soul heart, blue heart, uh, once every four rooms, guys, I think. But yeah, Cobalt does have the one up. Keep this in mind. So even if he does take that one hit, he'll actually respawn. Uh, I don't know how many hearts he's going to come back with, though. Because he just spent all the red ones that he had. I don't know how many it's going to spawn him with. So therein lies the question. I'm actually kind of curious now. I don't want to see him get hit here, but I am curious what he would come back with health-wise. Oh yeah, god, I forgot he's got money equals power too. Jesus. So Cobalt's got money equals power. Uh, oh my god. Wow. And yeah, he's just grinning ear to ear now. So and he's got Max's head. So even more damage up on Brimstone, which is almost completely overcapped anyways. Oh my lord. Wow, this build for Cobalt. Oh my lord. Yeah, game, stop. <laughs> what part of stop, game? Do not understand, game. Stop. <laughs> wow. This damage on Cobalt's run just, oh my mercy, is this ridiculous. Yeah, this is carried and then some. What's up, GQ? How you doing, sir? And why not? Let's have the compass, too, so that you can just make it that much quicker. My god. Uh, so the compass does exactly what you think it does. It's going to show you on your on your mini-map up in the top left uh, exactly where your item rooms, uh, shops, boss fights, um, challenge rooms, blood challenge rooms, libraries, curse rooms, things of that nature are. Uh, so basically, and there you go. Notice how quickly uh, Cobalt just ripped through that boss. Gish basically did not exist on Cobalt's screen. I didn't even get a chance to say who he was fighting, and it was dead. So there's your proof of why you want to have as much power as you can on your Brimstone. Oh boy, yeah, that notched pickaxe. I'm sure Cobalt's giddy right now with that. Now that'll be left behind. He'll take Dad's key over that any day. Yeah, he two-hit Gish. Enough said. That damage on, uh, wow. Cobalt's build is just ridiculous right now. 
So I think, at this point, Eddie, knowing what Cobalt's got working with him, is probably going to go to this boss fight and skip over his item room, but we'll have to see what happens. Because it's always a choice. Eh, maybe not. Eddie's going to go back for his item room. I take back what I said. Yeah, dead pickaxe. Get carried. Yeah, where was that depths one? I think he blinked is what happened. <laughs> Eh, shoot the whoop. Not exactly what Eddie was hoping for. That's basically a one-time use of Brimstone and definitely not at the same power level that Cobalt has. So it's it's okay, but not that great. Uh, now you notice Eddie's also got the Cancer Trinket. That actually doubles his tier rate. Uh, for, for Cobalt, on the other hand, uh, if I'm not mistaken, I believe, and don't quote me, but I believe that uh, Cancer does not affect your charge rate on Brimstone. Because from what I've done testing-wise, I did not see a difference. So I'm almost positive. What's up, Diana? Diana! Yeah, Dasky doesn't open locks. That makes sense. <laughs> what it is is you have to actually be in a fight. So, like, let's say right now, Cobalt were to use it. This would... Wow, that damage. Oh, my God. Yep, he's going to two-hit every boss. This is ridiculous right now. So there's that health up again for Cobalt. He's going to take the Polaroid with him because he has no trinket. Uh, Polaroid, when you get down to half a heart, uh, will actually... Or, uh, is it one heart or half a heart, guys? Either way, uh, it's half a heart. I know that now. Uh, when you get down to half a heart, it will actually give you a five-second damage shield, and that is also your entrance into the last level of the game. Uh, so if you beat the, uh, the Cathedral holding on to that Polaroid, uh, that'll actually take you into the final level. Yeah, hey, it's, uh, I thought it was Mom. <laughs> I blinked. Maybe it was Mom. Look at this. He just walks into rooms and whatever it is is dead. Like, this is ridiculous. Uh-oh. By the way, uh, Cobalt's pushing that uh, that third damage up because he is at 28 cents. So, again, for every 10 cents you pick up with money equals power, uh, you wind up actually getting one more damage up. So, in two more cents, if Cobalt were to find it, uh, he will actually get one more damage added on. Uh, you get a maximum of five with that. Uh, so at 50 cents, basically, you're going to cap out money equals power. But nonetheless, my god. Alright, that is... Uh, I can never think of the name of that thing. So let's see. Eddie working on... Again, he, uh, yeah. again Eddie's at the moment says Necropolis does not have a number on it. Uh, that's indicative of that being either the second of uh, the Depths floors or being an XL. Uh, being that we already know Eddie's fought through his Depths 1, this is Depths 2. Uh, and not an XL floor, but nonetheless, either way, it can show that to you. Flat Penny, thank you. Could not think of the name of it. God, that's terrible. So, Flat Penny, every time you pick up coins, has a chance to spawn keys for you. Uh, as you can see, Cobalt's going to pass on that for the Polaroid. That challenge room is a no thank you item. So, Cobalt will pass on that. Wow, look at that. One shotting a room of five enemies spread out across the room. Wow, this is why I love Brimstone, guys. For everybody that says, like, oh, Mom's Knife is more powerful. These are the rooms where Brimstone will make you think twice about what you just said. Because, yeah, you, you see how quickly Cobalt just tore through that room. Those enemies suck with Mom's Knife. Yep, exactly. Like you said, just blue baby it. Might as well. Yeah, if Cobalt can come across Guppy's Paw at this point, I guarantee you he's using it flat out guarantee he's using it because if you don't know like i said if you're below uh one red heart so if you're at half a red heart or less which doesn't really seem to make sense keep in mind but as you saw cobalt got rid of all of his red hearts at one point uh so let's say that he did that again with guppy's paw and took only blue hearts anytime he got hit he would get wow he would get an instantaneous five seconds of damage shield but there you go with him two hitting again on the boss so uh wow took a little bit of damage there too and nothing in Cobalt's Devil Deal that it is going to do him any good. He was, I think, hoping for Cole in there and fighting Krampus, but he didn't really need any more damage on his Brimstone. <laughs> that would have just been overkill. Oh, by the way, for those wondering, Cobalt also has the Mark. Uh, so he's got two damage up from originally picking up Money Equals Power. He's got two more from Money Equals Power. Uh-oh. What has happened here? I love that you can see Spazwant's catnip at the bottom of Eddie's screen. He couldn't take the cat. He only has one red heart. Impossible to buy something that's two hearts for, for the when you only have one. And at this point, why would he? His case in point, he's already found his mom's heart fight. So the nine lives would be kind of moot point for him. 
quite honestly, because he's already at, already at two, so. Um, Eddie, I think somehow something got really fucked up here. <laughs> something really got fucked up here. What has happened? Um, interesting. I didn't do anything, but my screen is now completely fucked. Um, that's mine. Now that's Eddie's doing. What the fuck is happening here? What the hell has happened to my freaking... Thing? Yeah, it's Eddie's. There we go. But my OBS was fucked up, too.